The overall goal of this experiment is to track platelet degranulation and secretion under flow using live cell imaging. This method can help to answer key questions in the field of platelet biology. The main advantage of this technique is that it enables a versatile investigation of platelet contents at the subcellular level in live cells. Though this method can provide insight into platelet function, it can also be applied to other cell types, such as mast cells. In general, individuals new to this method will struggle because of problems with platelet isolation in the form of preactivation. We first had the idea for this method when we realized that platelet secretion could only be evaluated at endpoint stages. Real-time images provide information of the release kinetics of platelet granule release. The procedure of platelet isolation will be demonstrated by Silvia Pignatelli, a student in our institute. Next, Arjen Barendrecht will demonstrate the real-time imaging experiments. To begin, degrease cover glasses by incubating them overnight in undiluted chromosulfuric acid. The next day, rinse them with distilled water. Then, place them overnight at 60 degrees Celsius in an oven to dry. Next, place a drop of water on a laboratory bench and adhere a 10 cm by 15 cm strip of a paraffin film on top of the drop by removing the air between the bench and the film. Then, pipette 80 microliter drops of 10 microgram per milliliter von Willebrand factor or 100 microgram per milliliter fibrinogen onto the paraffin film. Place the dry cover glasses.